ओके गाइस आई एम बैक विथ द न्यू बैंगर वीडियो एज यू गाइस वेल अवेयर दैट सैमसंग इज ट्राइंग टू गेट इन टू द बजट मार्केट अगेन विद द सैमसंग गैलेक्सी एम सीरीज सो गाइस सैमसंग हैज गॉन क्रेजी एंड रिलीजिंग अ लॉट ऑफ बजट स्मार्टफोन एंड अ वेरी गुड बजट स्मार्टफोन एंड रिसेंटली दे हैव रिलीज दिस सैमसंग गैलेक्सी एम थर्टी एस इन इंडिया एंड गाइज फॉर्चुनेटली आई गॉट इट हियर इट्स अ सिक्स थाउजेंड एम एच बैटरी वाला फोन सो लेट्स अनबॉक्स इट एंड लेट सी So hey what's up guys my name is Zaheer and this is the unboxing and first impression of this Samsung Galaxy M30s so let's begin So yeah this is the box guys this is how the box looks as you see M30s Samsung Samsung Galaxy M30s on the back there are some major specifications mentioned over here like 6000 mAh battery 48 megapixel triple camera super AMOLED screen which is a very important thing and a 2.3 gigahertz uh, exynos 9611 processor 4gb ram and 64gb of internal storage so yeah let's cut the seal and let's unbox it okay yeah so uh, on the top we got the phone itself so this is a phone guys inside the box it's a usb type c cable that's great thank you so much and we have this 9 volt 1.6 basically a 18 volt adapter inside the box that's great but this phone has 6000 mah battery even the 18 watts can charge it very quickly but yeah let's see so this is the phone guys this is the phone let me remove it from the plastic well it is quite plasticky and 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 i forgot there is something else in this this box we have this another pouch over here which contain the sim ejector pin and some paperwork one thing is surprising that uh, there is no cases bundled that's weird i would love to have a case samsung does not bundle any cases but as of the first impression this uh, back looks pretty cheap uh, so guys uh, till it's booting up let me give you a physical overview of this phone so as you see on the back we have some amazing things so the primary sensor is 48 megapixel samsung lens it's a f2.0 lens and then we have 8 megapixel ultra wide and 5 megapixel depth sensor and it can also shoot 4k video so that's great then we have this uh, flash a uh, fingerprint scanner and our samsung branding uh, moving to the right side we have the power button and the volume rocker tile and on the bottom we have the speaker grill primary microphone hole usb type c port and 3.5 mm headphone jack and on left side we have the you know sim card tray let's remove the sim card tray and let's see what type of combination they are offering right here so as you see over here guys we are getting this triple slot we are getting a dedicated sd card slot and dual sim card slot is also present so not bad and on the top there is a secondary noise cancellation microphone and in terms of the basic looks it looks good but does not feel premium and moving to the front We have this earpiece over here, and uh, this 16 megapixel f2.0 camera, and then we have this uh, 6.4 inches 1080p Super AMOLED display. Let me quickly set it up, then I will take a look. So guys, uh, the device has been booted up, and first of all, the display looks pretty fantastic, and looks like uh, this device is running on one UI. That's great, actually. So it is running on One UI Core 1.5, and the Android version is 9 Pi. So as you see, guys, out of 64 GB, 49 GB is free right now. This is how the display looks, guys. It looks pretty fantastic. Wow, the AMOLED display is good. It's great, actually. Uh, now let's let's the speakers, guys. So guys this is how the speaker sounds. Well It's okay in my opinion. Uh, guys uh, let's quickly test the cameras of this phone. Uh, let me take a picture of this knife first with a normal lens then with a wide angle lens. Let's take some more pictures with a normal lens. Uh okay. So this is a 48 megapixel lens photo guys. I mean it is not a 48 megapixel picture definitely. As you see this is just a 12 megapixel picture 3000 by 4000 resolution for so 12 megapixel 12 million pixel and uh, the picture seems out to be really okay in my opinion. The details are not as good as the IMX 586 uh, as of the first impression. As you see it is good it is good not bad at all. Okay so let's take some front facing photos. Okay 
Oh my god, even the front facing camera has some wide angle one. As you see, this is the normal mode and this is the wide angle mode. So this is a front facing camera selfie guys. Uh, it's uh, okay in my opinion. You can't count my beard here. So yeah, this was the cameras of this phone guys. Let's quickly set up the fingerprint scanner and test it. Well, it is a very different type of fingerprint scanner system. I don't have to tap to register the fingerprint. I just have to swipe down on my finger and it will register. So that's great. Let's test the fingerprint scanner. It is quite quick guys. I mean, it's not the fastest one that I've seen. The Redmi Note 5 Pro, Realme 5 Pro and the Realme, even Realme 5 has a better and faster fingerprint scanner. But this is a Samsung phone guys. So as per the Samsung phone, this it is quite reasonable. So now let's enable the face unlock and let, let's test the face unlock too. So guys, let's try face unlock. Okay. Wow, it's quick. Well, well, it's quick and it has always on display. Wow. Okay. So as you see, guys, it has this kind of always on display. My God, this is just a 14,000 rupees smartphone and it has a always on display. And I have this one plus 70. It costs 38,000 rupees, even though it does not have always on display. What are you doing one plus? What are you doing? The always on display is amazing. As of the first impression, guys, this device seems pretty good. It has uh, the Exynos 9611 processor. It's a 10 nanometer processor. It looks good. Uh, I will test the performance in the gaming and the performance review. And in my full review, I will give my verdict. And as of now, it seems pretty snappy as you see over here and the one UI is working pretty well over here and it has a 64 GB UFS 2.1 storage so that will also contribute into the speeding of the device and it has 6000 mAh battery which is insane so I will test everything and the camera review the gaming review everything will be live soon so yeah stay tuned on the channel so yeah guys that's all about the unboxing and first impression of this Galaxy M30s and I have to say I am pretty impressed with this phone as of the first impression especially the display and the battery life of course, I have not tested the battery life yet, but uh, as per the 6000 mAh, it will gonna last a long time. I know that. So yeah, that's all in this video, guys. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, then hit that like button, share this video with your friends who are looking to buy this smartphone or who are looking to buy any smartphone in the price category of 15,000 or, or below 15,000. So it, this video will be very, very helpful for them. So yeah, feel free to share this video. And guys, if you love my content, you can subscribe this channel and hit that bell notification icon so you'll be notified when I post next video or new videos on this phone and another phones like OnePlus 70 and all. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Bye.